Hello everyone, this is Kyle from We Tech Care of You, and today I'm just going to show you this little application that I've made. So I've made an invoice generator, and I've made this as a Power Apps Canvas app, and obviously this is all free with your licensing, so there's nothing extra for this. But I just want to show you what I've whipped up, and I'm going to give you a little demo of this, and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to upload a series on how to build this from scratch, um, and it's going to be like a four or five part series, um and it'll just show you how to build the form all the automation behind it and, and the html generation as well so i just want to show you the actual application so what we've got here is an invoice generator you know it automatically gets the day's date you can't change this the invoice number increments by one every time you do an invoice so again you can't really change that that's just automatically generated um and the back end of this is a sharepoint sharepoint list multiple sharepoint lists um for the back end so what i've got here as well i've hard coded the vendor details because obviously this is coming from self however you've got your bill to thing here so i've just pre-populated this to save time but you know you've got you can put your customer name in street address whoever you want to bill your invoice to now coming into this next section as you can see here we've got like a gallery so i've already pre-populated this just again to save time but what you can do here is you can just add your records to the invoice so if i just put you know 60 units test demo you can put the amount that you want to charge for that so if i just put 2000 there if you notice when i click off that it automatically formats that with the the, um, the decimal place you know the thousand separator and your dollar sign and then what i can do is i can add that row to the invoice so as you can see the test demo at the bottom now as you can see as well here we've got this little bin here so if you you know you add something by accident you can literally just delete that now as well what i want to show you at the bottom here is we we're all it's automatically calculating the sale amount the gst of that and balance due so that's just automatically calculated from what you put in here so again if you see this so i just put test demo again uh, five hours so you'll see this automatically go up by 500 and then if i just delete that that'll automatically just remove that so so there's your total prices as well for this now what i've then done for this is when once you've done your invoice and everything's ready you can click submit so if i just click submit to this now this will obviously clear the form as you can see it's just incremented to the next number there as well so that's ready for the next invoice and then what i've done for this automation is when you submit that form i've got it to generate all of that into a pdf attach it to an email and then at the moment it'll just send to myself in an email now you could obviously set this to send straight to the person you're sending the invoice to um there's just so many opportunities that you can do with this but for this example this is just going to send to me so i can show you this so i'm just going to wait for this email to come through um okay so the email arrives so as you can see hello please find attached invoice from we take care of you and um, regards and then you've got your attachment there so invoice 19 so if i just open up this invoice there you can see so there you can see that's nicely formatted you've got your date you've got your address formatted into correct format you've got your logo applied there's all the item that you added to that invoice there's your total address and there's your pdf generated so i feel like this is this could be you know very beneficial to a lot of people as I said, I'm going to stick up a series on how to build this whole process from scratch, from start to finish. Um, and you can see the link to that series in the description. But this was just a quick demo of the app that I built. So uh, I hope I hope this can help someone. And uh, please like and subscribe to the channel. And take care. Thank you.